Hi there! If you're like me, tackling the online school can feel sometimes like going through uncharted waters. But fear not. I have gathered five essential tips to help you sail through the virtual classroom and schooling with ease. Let's dive in. First things first, create a dedicated study space. Whether it's a corner of your room or a cozy nook, having a designated area helps signal to your brain that it's time to focus. Keep it organized and free from distractions. That way, when it's time to hit the books, you're ready to go. Next up, establish a consistent schedule. Treat your online classes like you would traditional ones. Set specific times for studying, attending lectures, or taking breaks. This helps maintain a structure and prevents procrastination. Plus, it's easier to manage your workload when you have a plan in place. And number three, don't be a passive observer in the virtual classroom. Engage in discussions, ask questions, and share your thoughts. Active participation not only enhances your learning, but also fosters a sense of connection with your peers and teachers. Remember, learning is a collaborative process, even in the digital realm. It is essential to give your mind and body a break regularly. Staring at a screen for extended periods can lead to fatigue and decreased productivity. So, schedule short breaks throughout your study sessions, whether it's a quick walk around the block or a few minutes of stretching. Recharge your batteries before diving back into your course work. Lastly, take advantage of the plethora of resources available to you online, from virtual libraries to study groups. There's a wealth of tools at your fingertips to enhance your learning experience. Don't hesitate to reach out to your teachers and classmates for help when needed. We're all in this together. And there you have it. Five essential tips to help you thrive in online learning. Remember, stay organized, stick to the schedule, engage actively, take breaks, and use available resources. With a little bit of determination and with these tips, you've got this. Happy studying.